in the Lord's house there are many rooms. And what we learn through the study of God that we take on as a hobby, which is our right under the First Amendment with regard to freedom of assembly and freedom of religion, is that we have the freedom to look things over. We have the freedom to consider. We have the freedom to theologize. And openly we have the freedom to do things. When people want to reject the Lord, they really reject themselves because they're rejecting what God has for them. And that's kind of foolery in itself. You see, most of us aren't as smart as God, and few of us are as good as God. And many times people don't even praise God or worship God or sing to the Lord or dance unto the Lord. When you dance unto the Lord, you have a chance with the Lord. When you sing to God, you have the chance to move someone's soul. And when you do some good theater or production work or presentation, then God is pleased. Because what you're doing is showing that you are living without disease. When I say it like this in rhyme and time, what I'm really talking about is your situation, not mine. Because what I'm really encouraging you to do is find the magic of Jesus or the magic of God or the magic of whatever deity you believe in. Because if you don't find that magic, then you might miss out on all the things that God has planned for you.